This is the five ways of classifying programming languages. Two. The next one is the programming languages that use a compiler versus an interpreter. With a compiler, for example, C++ or C use a compiler. So what they basically do is the compiler is a program that takes all the source code and translate it directly into machine code. So you've got a programming a program that says oh do this thing for three loops then the machine the compiler is going to translate that into zeros and ones so that the machine can directly read that in ones meanwhile the co interpreter what it does is for example with the example of python python is convert is compiled to bytecode of python which is a two process step and then this bytecode that is another low-level programming language is then interpreted by the Python uh, interpreter. What it does, it basically goes line by line of the code, reading and translating to the machine. And every time the code is repeated, for example, you have to repeat a task or a function is repeated continuously over time, every time the code is repeated, the machine is reading and interpreting again the thing into machine code. So as you can guess, uh, using a programming language that is, a, that is an interpreter is way slower. It doesn't make a big difference for us, for humans, because we cannot probably perceive that. Like It's not like 10 seconds slower, it's like 0 0.1, 0 0.5, you know? But for, for example, for things that, are, that require a high speed, for example, embed systems, Internet of Things, those things require programming languages that are compiled, like C or C++. That's why they're so popular with Arduino, for example, or Raspberry Pi.